My dear extraordinary youth, you were sent to Earth at this precise time, the most crucial time in the history of the world, to help gather Israel. There is nothing happening on this Earth right now that is more important than that. There is nothing of greater consequence, absolutely nothing. This gathering should mean everything to you. This is the mission for which you were sent to Earth. So now I am inviting every young woman and every young man between the ages of 12 and 18 in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints to enlist in the youth battalion of the Lord to help gather Israel. The Book of Mormon is central to the gathering of Israel. In fact, if there were no Book of Mormon, the promised gathering of Israel would not occur. So my first invitation to you today is to disengage from a constant reliance on social media by holding a seven-day fast from social media. I acknowledge that there are positives about social media, but if you are paying more attention to feeds from social media than you are to the whisperings of the Spirit, then you are putting yourself at spiritual risk, as well as the risk of experiencing intense loneliness and depression. Another downside of social media is that it creates a false reality. Everyone posts their most fun, adventurous, and exciting pictures, which create the erroneous impression that everyone except you is leading a fun, adventurous, and exciting life. Much of what appears in your various social media feeds is distorted, if not fake. So give yourself a seven-day break from fake. My second invitation is to make a weekly sacrifice of time to the Lord for three weeks in a row to let Him know that you want to be part of His youth battalion more than you want anything else. For three weeks, give up something you like to do and use that time to help gather Israel. Any time you do anything that helps anyone on either side of the veil, take a step toward making covenants with God and receiving their essential baptismal and temple ordinances, you are helping to gather Israel. It is as simple as that. As you pray about this sacrifice of time, you will be guided to know both what you can give up that week and what you can do instead to help gather Israel. My third invitation is for you to do a thorough life assessment with the Lord, and perhaps with your parents and your bishop, to ensure that your feet are firmly planted on the covenant path. If you have wandered off, or if there are some things you need to let go of to help your mind and heart be more pure, Today is the perfect time to change. If you aren't sure how to repent, talk with your bishop or your parents or both. They will help you understand the Atonement of Jesus Christ. They will help you experience the joy that true repentance always brings. Please do not stay off the covenant path one more minute. Please come back through true repentance now. My fourth invitation is for you to pray daily that all of God's children might receive the blessings of the gospel of Jesus Christ. You and I are living to see and will continue to see Israel gathered with great power and you can be part of the power behind that gathering. My fifth invitation is for you to stand out, be different from the world. You and I know that you are to be a light to the world. Therefore, the Lord needs you to look like, sound like, act like, and dress like a true disciple of Jesus Christ. Yes, you are living in the world, 
but you have very different standards from the world to help you to avoid the stain of the world. With the Holy Ghost as your companion, you can see right through the celebrity culture that has smitten our society. You can be smarter than previous generations have ever been. And if you are sometimes called weird, wear that distinction as a badge of honor and be happy that your light is shining brightly in this ever darkening world. Set a standard for the rest of the world. Embrace being different. Discuss the standards with your friends. Decide how you can live these standards, your standards, with even more exactness. Now let me summarize by reviewing my five invitations for you to enlist in the Lord's Youth Battalion to help gather Israel. One, hold a seven-day fast from social media. Two, make a weekly sacrifice of time to the Lord for three weeks. Three, keep on the covenant path. If you are off, repent and get back on the path. Four, pray daily that all of God's children might receive the blessings of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Five, stand out, be different, be a light. Give to a friend one copy of the booklet for the strength of youth. My beloved younger brothers and sisters, you are among the best the Lord has ever sent to this world. You have the capacity to be smarter and wiser and have more impact on the world than any previous generation. From the depths of my soul, I testify that this is the work of Almighty God. He lives. Jesus is the Christ. This is His church restored to accomplish its divine destiny, including the promised gathering of Israel. You are the hope of Israel, children of the promised day. I so testify in the name of Jesus Christ, amen.